Good evening. Actually, you have several brains. That's the good news. So you got a few spares in there. You got the neocortex, which is the right and left hemisphere. You got your limbic brain, which you share with mammals, and the reptilian brain, evolutionarily the most ancient associated with body language. Let's sing a song together, though. Will you sing with me? Row, row, row your boat gently down the stream. Merrily, 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 life is but a dream. Now, of course, the first part of any song is the information, the literal meaning. That goes with the left hemisphere, the beta level. Imagine a press conference, Mr. President, what happened to the ACA website? The formal answer would be, I do not know. That's the beta level brain speaking. We use it with strangers. The beta level is left hemisphere, linear thinking, that focal visual part of the brain. Anybody here like to read? You know how you have those page turners? You're actually tracking the beast of meaning. You're using the same parts of your brain that evolutionarily would have been tracking in the forest. The alpha level, wider lens here, it's the social, it's the memory, it's the context. Mr. President, what about that website? I don't know, I don't know. That's the alpha response, holistic, all at once. But a more typical response would be, dude, that night we spent in Barcelona. <laughs> you might hear, that, hear something like that here tonight. Uh, focus is not propositional meaning. <laughs> it's relation. And of course, when you're slightly inebriated, you can learn a language better, thanks to your friend Alpha Brain. Limbic system is the one that we share with mammals. And uh, the tunes and tones with which I'm singing to you right now are controlled by the limbic brain, Mr. President. What about that website? Mm. Mm. <laughs> That's theta talking. What would you say when you see something like this? We do, ouch, nanner, nanner. Psst, wow, whoa, this is theta level interjections. Note there's no grammar. I will have ouched, I shall have been ouching. Go home tonight and try this out. Oh, Fluffy, I'm never going to give you another biscuit again. I'm never going to take you for a walk and your dog's tail will wag. <laughs> because you share the limbic system, that's what connects us with each other and with other species. The reptilian brain controls body language and is the, the, sor the source of spatial reasoning. Mr. President, why is the website not working? That's the delta level. It, you get into trouble, though, when there's a mismatch between the words and the body language. <laughs> Might have had a conversation like this in your own life. What happens is the delta level will automatically overrule whatever it is you think you're saying with your other brain. So you need to take control of your body language. But wait, that's not all. We have good news. The gamma level is where we tie it all together. This is the place for epiphany, that space of flow that space of healing, inner hemispheric synchronization, healing and reconciliation that speaks to the commonality underneath difference. So certain people have that ability to speak to us in a way that reconnects us with uh, some other aspect of our nature. And this is the gamma level talk. Of course, in everyday conversation, you might hear something like this, where we have somebody in alpha, and what they're really asking, of course, is do you love me? <laughs> <laughs> so these mismatches are the source of a lot of pain in our lives, you know, and, uh, pay attention to this. And of course, online, we inadvertently are uh, dishing each other all the, all the time because you have to fill in the missing body language and tone of voice. And so it's really easy to flame people without even meaning to. And if you mean to, it's even easier. <laughs> So you got to shift gears. You got to be willing to, to be flexible. And op with the, the opening song, if you recall, there's another version of it that I want to um, uh, bring to you, which goes, propel, propel, propel your craft languidly down the liquid solution. <laughs> ecstatically, 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 existence is but an illusion. <laughs> That's the beta level version of the opening song. It's the historical <laughs> unpleasantness, Battle of Hastings, 1066, look it up. So. Um, so what, you gotta notice what gear you're in and then whoever you're with, you know, be meshing with them, be in rapport, maintain that rapport, dance with the flux. You have this amazing evolutionary heritage, it's time to claim it. There's missing chapters in the missing manual on your brain. I think several of them should be about language because it is that which both describes and creates reality. And if existence is but a grammatically induced hallucination, what is the world that we will sing into being? That is the question I leave you with tonight. Thank you very much. <laughs>